Hey yo, say ho, welcome back to K, those reacts facts man, welcome back, and today we got Yo-Yo 808 in the building, right, this one's called My First Time Getting Box on Tinder, that sounds wild, I don't know how y'all was using them dating apps bro, I, so many story people getting like snatched up or me getting catfished, it's like Mmm, nah, and I've had to get a couple homeboys out of the situation <laughs> from them from them dating apps too. So I'm already knowing how that shit go, bro. But we gonna see what he talking about on here, man. It says gone wrong, so clearly something happened, man. How 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 you and your brother be be fumbling the bag, man? You and Stanley be missing out on some on some cool to mama, bro. You know what? We're gonna see what, what Yo Yo got to say today, man. All right? Yeah, I know what to do though. Hit that like button, subscribe, comment, and subscribe. You feel me? Link will be down in the description. Go check his channel out after you leave here. You can check out my social media accounts as well down there. Without further ado, we're gonna get straight to it, bro. I hope y'all enjoy. Let's roll. Aside from recess and PE as a kid, I never really played any type of sport. I know my appearance is otherwise, but I'm just tall and my body puts on muscle for some reason. I could not tell you why. See, the thing about my side. Well, it feels like yesterday this nigga was skinny as shit with pink ass uh, wicks in his head, bro. And this nigga swole his head with a, with a little fro on now. W gains, yo, yo. W gains, man. That it gives me this obnoxious sense of confidence to do things that I see actually athletic people do. Like, I'll see some crazy shit and, like, gaslight myself into thinking that I can do it. Like, an Olympic diver can jump from 32 feet in the air, flip around in the most elegant way with perfect understanding of physics, and then mm -hmm. land with perfect execution. <laughs> but that nigga can't bench 315, bro. I, I can jump off a diving board and do the... <laughs> <laughs> so recently I went hooping with some friends. A sport that I have zero experience in. I got no badges, bro. That's tough. <laughs> so we're at a 24-hour fitness. I'm shooting by myself and my friends are running a game. And after about 30 minutes of not hitting anything, I look over at my friends and they're hitting three-pointers. That man putting more bricks up than a cement mason. God damn. Layups. I'm at the free throw line looking at them. And something tells me to try to dunk for no reason. I have never in my life even attempted to dunk. To be honest, I don't even know how high I can jump because I know I have no business being more than like two inches off the ground because I'm, I'm gonna hurt myself. But here I am sprinting to the hoop. I get closer, I take one large step. Us, I take another large step. Us, I swing my arms and jump as high as I physically can and just slam the ball into the rim. But I can't even pay attention to the basketball hurtling to the other side of the gym because I'm realizing Oh shit, I gotta land. The fact that I have time to think about it shows that my 220 pound ass <laughs> was way higher than I had any business being. My knees are not meant to take the full force of my body weight hurtling to the ground without basketball shoes, bro. I'm wearing Converse. I'm about to catch the full force of my body with zero support. Like I'm looking at the ground. Oh, uh, your ankles done, especially if they low, uh, low top. Shit gonna hurt. I land. Pain, bro. My shit hurts to this day. <laughs> Tell you all this day, was in my <laughs> Nah, that shin pain be a whole. That's a whole nother level of pain, bro. That shin. How you that damn big and can't land on your knees, bro? You ain't in your dead list or nothing, bro. Big as hell and can't and can't jump up and down. What the hell? To completely overestimate the physical capabilities of my body. So here's the actual story. So I'm swiping on Tinder and I end up matching with this girl. We start talking, we set up a date for the next day. Either my game is immaculate or this girl doesn't know about stranger danger. The next day comes <laughs> along and I'm at the gym because that is a pre-date essential. Men, no matter what body type you have, get a pump before going on a date. It's like getting an erection, but on your muscles. So I'm there to hit a quick full body thing. I'm kind of in a rush though, cause the date's in like an hour and a half and the gym is like 20 minutes away and I still need to drive back and get ready. Well, I speed through my upper body stuff and now I just have legs. I head to the squat rack and this dude catches my attention because of how freaking massive his legs were. This dude was thick. Like jump to get into jeans thick. Like ice spice. Hey yo, what, what he only worked his legs out? He wasn't 
Work in his arms either? Did I cut myself? I don't know. Music video background dancer thing, bro. This is that anyways. He's doing background dancer is crazy. Squat variation where his feet are together and he's standing on top of a 25 pound weight and he's just squatting like that. Now me on a time crunch sees this and I'm like, oh. He knows what he's doing. I'm gonna just do that. So I hop on the rack. I don't warm up or stretch because I don't really got time for that. I toss a plate and a 25 on the bar and I get to it. Very early in, I realized something about bro. He is not okay mentally because there is no <laughs> way he enjoys this variation of squat because my quads are on fire, bro. I am in pain. But this small waist, pretty face with a big bank ass nigga is just repping out 315 with this form. So I push through and do four sets of 12. I re-rack and see him go down to a weight that I'm actually able to do with the regular squat form. So I think to myself, how cool would it be if I could match weight with someone this Big, even if it's just for one set. I have no business doing this weight with this new form because I'm going to hurt myself. So I load it up, get ready to do my set, and it was horrible, bro. If I wasn't motivated by this dude's legs, I wouldn't have gotten it up. Pause. Pause. Yeah, yeah. Big pause. Because what? <laughs> what? That was crazy. What, what did that have to do with anything? But by God's mercy, I complete the rep and proceed to do that three more times. So with nothing spotting me but ego and hopes and dreams, I re-rack, <laughs> pack it up, and go home. Now I'm limping to my car, but that's ordinary if you hit legs hard enough. So I get home, get dressed, and head out to pick up Shorty. So we go on the date, we have a good time, I take her back to my place, we chill there for a little bit, and one thing leads to another, and we start wrestling. So I put on the proper gear to <laughs> start wrestling. Hey, very kid-friendly of you, Yo-Yo. W kid friendly channel. Tech to myself and I start doing my thing. I'm standing on the edge of the wrestling mat and all is going well till I feel this tingling in my quad. So I grab my quad and keep going, but eventually that tingling turns into a cramp. Now anyone who has <laughs> caught leg cramps before knows that <laughs> the That Charlie was that Charlie Hose boy. That Charlie was a killer, man. You ever woke up with a Charlie Horse cup, boy? You have a good sleep, and then your shit just, ah, this is, ah. you sitting there with your leg up in there like one of them strippers, I'm not putting my leg up, but you get the point, bro, <laughs> leg be all the way up here and shit, bro, that shit be hurting, and it hurt for a good little minute, too, it's just vibrating and tightening and shit, bro, like, what's, what's the reason, what's the reason, man, what's the reason, hamstring? I would be in the fetal position, but I don't want this girl to think I'm bad at wrestling. So the show goes on, but like the cramp gets worse and worse until I eventually have to stop. She looks at me like, what's wrong? Not nothing. I just got to go to the bathroom real quick. So I get up, but I'm telling you, bro, I'm supposed to be limping right now. But my leg is in too much pain for me to walk normally, but I cannot give this girl the ick. I want to give her the, so I walk into the bathroom. <laughs> Yeah, all that. Totally. I close the door and I start going through it, bro. I look at my leg and it is fully flexed, bro. I cannot move at all. I'm just looking at the mirror in absolute pain. But I can't grunt or anything because I don't want to alarm Shorty. So I'm. <sighs> <laughs> ah. Bro, I am <laughs> dying in that bathroom quietly of course but like i'm trying to figure out what the hell happened but then i realized i didn't stretch before i did those material girl ass squats leg day cramps for me at least last forever so i know i'm not going to be able to finish with this girl so i cut my losses and put my foot against the wall next to the door and start stretching it out so i'm waiting for it to go away but then i catch a cramp in my other leg i'm telling you right now damn the double cramp damn bro double cramp is crazy Ooh. Yeah, wrap it up. Wrap it on up, gang. And not just your willy. Just wrap it on up and go. <laughs> yeah, it's time to go, baby girl. Can't I can't do it unless you want to take over. <laughs> hey, ain't nothing else to do unless you want to take over. 
And she, from the sound of it, she was a pillow princess, so she wasn't doing nothing. You hear me? I have never fallen to the ground at a faster velocity, bro. I don't got any legs. What am I supposed to do? My naked body slaps my cold bathroom floor. I knock <laughs> things off my counter, and I'm just laying there. Shorty comes in and sees me sprawled out, gripping both of my legs, and the jig is up. I'm caught because, mind you, I still haven't let out a peep. But the second I realize she caught me... Ah! <laughs> I went, oh, I'm going crazy, bro. I'm letting out like five minutes of pain, and this poor girl doesn't know what to say because she had no clue I caught the cramp in the first place. So I tell her what happened, and she helps me up, and I'm limping to the bed. But, bro, I catch two calf cramps. I shoot both of my legs out in pain, bro. I got. God damn. The calves, too? Boy, don't ever do them bitches again in your life. <laughs> Whatever exercise you did, you better not ever do that shit again, bro. Unless you're trying to get your form right. Four separate cramps in my legs at this point. I fall, and this girl could not support my body weight, bro. We both fall. She hits her face on the ground, and I land right on top of her hard like she's gonna feel it tomorrow hard type shit i try to save the situation try to like <laughs> tell some jokes but there there isn't much i can do i'm not gonna lie we're chilling on the floor for a little bit but eventually she gets up and leaves and i'm just staring at the ceiling thinking about how i had no business doing those squats like that without stretching moral of the story Know what your body is capable of. Body pee might be racing the whip. I'm getting tired of chasing the shit. You would think that I sold him a naughty the way I get straight to the bitch. Give me straight to the bitch. Kudos. Back, back in the. Damn, that man caught four cramps. After. Damn. Damn. I done caught it one Charlie horse on one leg, and that was it before. And I was out. And I was out for the count. So not only. You caught two Charlie horses. Both, both hamstrings is tight. Yo, cat, cat crabs don't really hurt that bad, though. I think it depends. Calves don't really hurt that bad, though. Yeah, he out the game with that one. You got you got all four at once time, bro. Yeah, wrap it on up, gang. And, of course, she don't know what to do. <laughs> she came for some... You feel me? She wasn't, she wasn't trying to... Uh, nurse someone back to health. She came over there to get worked out. You <laughs> goddamn me. So, damn, that's tough. Hope, hope, hope you got a second chance, my boy, so you can get a a rest a wrestling rematch. You feel me? <laughs> damn, boy, that is tough. That is that is tough. Damn, I couldn't imagine. The double, the double cramps. Yeah, go ahead and go to sleep, Bucko. It's over with. But uh, <laughs> my first time getting box on Tinder gone wrong. Y'all better stay off them dating apps, man, before you be next year. I mean, I say, just be safe, be smart. Uh, it's, these are strangers. You don't know who they are. Yeah, they in your area, but that don't mean you feel me. Everything is right. So, uh, with that being said, I ain't got nothing else to say, man. Y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments. Y'all tell me some stories about y'all catching the cramp while y'all was wrestling. You feel me? <laughs> or tell some tender stories. Tell some tender stories, too. Y'all can do that, too. I'm gone, man. I hope y'all enjoy the rest of y'all day, man. hope y'all enjoyed this video. I'm out. Peace.